Hey YouTube, it's Willow. I just wanted to show you some of my some of my tools that I use, but only the ones that I made myself because I like to make all that I can. Um, first is this. All it is just a little thing that I got at Walmart, but I painted it, and I use it to put my candles on in. Uh, in my um for my fire a representation of fire on my altar and so I painted the sun and yeah because but I think it's really pretty and I like it um the second thing is is my wand and this is it I know it's kind of bulky but I love it um it was just a stick that I found on the ground and I thought it was pretty and just some random quartz point that I had and then I have stones on it to represent the chakras because I really like the sh I, I like the, um, working with the chakras and stuff so and I really like it um, I don't use it that much but I love it um, the third thing is this is not really a tool but um, this is the only the first one I ever made so it's not very good I don't know where my other ones are but this is I make candles this one smells really good. Oh, what did I put in here? I think it was like lemongrass and grapefruit and thyme. But I wish you could smell it because it smells absolutely amazing. And I really like it. Um, another thing is, this is a box that I keep my oracle and tarot cards in. And all it was is I got it for like two bucks at Walmart and I painted it. Let's see. And on the side it has sayings you know like and harm none or and harm none do what you will and blessed be and just different things like that but um, and on the corners I have the the triple goddess and then the triquatra right you can't really tell what it is but and then obviously the pentacle in the middle I really like it see I have my and I also have my, my little journal that I write my stuff in so um, another thing is I make little drawstring bags, like pouches. I made this. Um, this is the one I keep my pendulum in. But, see, I made it, I made it myself. And I really like doing these a lot. They're so much fun to do and they're super uber easy. Alright, the next three things that I made have to do with ceramics. I really like ceramics and I'm going to try and go back to my high school on Tuesdays so I can do more. This is a bowl that I made a long time ago, like a really long time ago. It just has rocks in it. Um, I This is the bowl I kind of use, kind of like on my secondary altar. It's not really an altar, but it's more of like, like I have the representation of the elements. It's kind of like a, I don't know, but it's like, in my, it's another one in my room. I really like it. Although, I wasn't very good at glazing then, so <laughs> it's really bad at the bottom. Um, another thing is, is this is what I used to burn my uh, like powdered incense in. See, it has sand and charcoal in there, but I also did this on the wheel. Um, it's actually pretty nice. The glazing job isn't very good, but yeah. <laughs> and this last one is my pride and joy, and I definitely want to make more. I made my own mortar and pestle. I made this myself. Here's, see. Yep. And I made this on the wheel and I made this by hand. And it works really nicely. Um, I'm very, very, very happy with it. And you can't really tell what the glaze is, but there's, it's like a bone color. And there's a line, it doesn't go all the way to the top. And it doesn't on here either, so that way I didn't break the glaze when I was grinding. But it works really well, and I love it. So this is my pride and joy. Um, and that's uh, that's at least all I can find of what I've made. So if you guys have any questions, just ask. And thanks for watching. Blessed be. If that's a tear I see, if it's because of me. I may well have to tell you what I would do